I'm currently making breakfast. If you've seen my last few vlogs, then you know that Christian and I are on this breakfast kick with the Trader Joe's hash browns, a runny egg, and avocado in between. But um, I'm making another coffee. This is the best way to get the Starbucks sweet cream cold foam at home. This is the best creamer. You just put it in a frother or you can buy a handheld frother off of Amazon. But I just have the Nespresso frother that came with my Nespresso machine. And you put this on cold froth. You can do any pod you like. I have been loving this Costa Rica pod. It's really good. And then also the Bianco Ligero, which is my favorite. But you can do any pod that you'd like. So I'm gonna do a Gran Lungo. It's just an Americano version on an espresso shot. You just pour this in and then you cold froth it. You don't need a lot of it because it's really sweet. So that's my little cold foam Starbucks hack. And it literally looks like Starbucks at home. And it tastes just as good too. And then here's breakfast. I mix everything but the bagel in the avocado, but I just top it with a little bit more on top. And it is so good. Good morning. I hate the lighting in here, it's so bad. But I haven't really started off this vlog. Hi, uh, welcome back to another video. My name's Lauren, if you're new. I'm going to my best friend Taylor's birthday brunch slash lunch at a place called 60 Vines. And I love that place. I've only been once, but the time that I went, it was so good, so I'm so excited. I'm about to start getting ready. Probably just gonna wear something that, like a romper that I've had for so long and call it a day but i'm excited to go and see her and celebrate her her birthday was actually yesterday but obviously that was yesterday was friday so my sister's birthday is actually tomorrow so i'm going to like a surprise thing at her work her friend her best friend taylor i think i think it was taylor maybe other people put together this little surprise um, birthday thing so and my sister works at a bar downtown so we do that tomorrow and then my friend Taylor has another birthday celebration tomorrow night at 7 so it's just like a weekend full of birthday celebrations <laughs> Outfit. I've had it for so long, so I'm sorry that I can't link it. It's from the store. I think it's Vici Dolls. I also have another romper that's from them as well. And they do like good sales too. And I'm wearing like these really big Madewell hoops. Really big. They're kind of heavy. I have ones from Amazon that are like a little bit smaller and hollow. So they're not as heavy and they're like okay to wear every day. These I couldn't wear all day. So that's the only con with these made wall hoops because they're just kind of heavy and I don't prefer to wear like heavy earrings. I'm really sad because I just changed the water on these and then all of a sudden they died. So they're not really doing so well, but they were so pretty the other day. I wish flowers lasted longer than a week, you know? And I finally threw out the flowers from Christian and I's three year anniversary because I don't know why I was holding on to them for so long because the guy told Christian that the flowers would last two weeks, at least two weeks. And they didn't even last a week. Like they barely lasted four days, which kind of sucks. So I was like holding on to them and I finally just threw them out last night. <laughs> Can you guys say?
own shoes because we're going to my sister's bar that she works at and her friends coordinated like a surprise so we have to be there by like 1 20 because she's gonna be there at like 1 30 so we're going there to surprise her and i didn't feel like doing my hair so i just put hairspray in it and didn't curl it or didn't really do anything to it because i kind of want to put it up but like holding myself back from putting it up so yeah we just got ready to go there and hang out for a little bit i have to go to the grocery store and then i have taylor's um she was in clips from yesterday she's having another birthday celebration tonight at seven at agave azul so i'm going to that but as for now we're just getting ready to 12 30 so we have to leave soon so that way we can park and walk to the bar and then we'll surprise her and stay for a little bit and then i need to go to the grocery store and then get ready for that dinner tonight get ready for the work week because the weekend is already almost done which is sad they go by so fast it has been the craziest last few hours so it's a little bit later christian and i surprised my sister at her job for her birthday and before that happened we went to the grocery store and christian wanted to try like a new laura bar and the Lara bars are really good like we just tried like a banana bread one and it's so good but he's allergic to cashews and he got one that had cashews in it and he started eating it in the car i was like whoa 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 wait a second there's nuts in there what type of nuts are in there and he swallowed a little bit of it but he like literally spit like the whole mouthful of the bar out and like only had a little bit of cashews but cashews literally make him like throw up and he just feels so sick and gross it's been just like a rough rough few hours for him he needs to eat something so we're getting five guys so he's in there right now but i wanted to update the vlog because literally it's just been crazy it's kind of like scary and i was like a little bit stressed for a little bit so he's feeling a little bit better now so we're eating lunch five guys i think we're gonna take it down to the lake and eat at the lake. Okay, we just got home and I just checked the mailbox before we came inside. And I ordered something, not from Set Active, but it is a Set Active item that I got off Poshmark. So if you're interested in sold out colors, or any set active potentially for a discounted price check poshmark and she even sent it in the original bag but this is a very hard color to find because it's newly sold out it's the oat milk color and if you've been watching my videos sorry they're wrinkly because i wore them but i wanted to pull them out of my hamper so i could show you um if you remember a few months ago i got in my first pair of set active leggings in the oat milk color so this is them and I didn't buy a matching sports bra or anything. So ever since I got into buying more set active stuff, like the stuff that I showed you a few vlogs ago of the biker shorts and the sports bras that I got in. But I was on the hunt for some type of sports bra in the oat milk color. I wasn't necessarily looking for this specific sports bra. I was just looking for any type of sports bra because when they do release a color, they release it in that color in all of their sports bras and they have like five different sports bras and this is one of them so i wasn't necessarily looking at f looking for it in this i guess shape but one person on poshmark was selling it and so i snagged it but yeah so i'm excited now that i have a matching bra with the leggings so I just wanted to show you. So if you're interested in set active stuff or pieces that are sold out or you have leggings or just the sports bra, check on Poshmark because people are constantly selling stuff like old colors or sold out colors. They might be a little bit more expensive, but yeah, so I just got that. So I'm going to wash this. <laughs> I 
I just got out of Ulta because I don't even know I was sitting on my couch and I was like ooh, let me just go ahead and buy the gift that I'm getting for Taylor so that way I can just go and like pick it up on my way to dinner I saw that they closed at 6 so I quickly got up and went to Ulta so I got her this Bally Body One Hour Express in dark which I've never tried before she uses it and I think she loves it and this is what she asked for so I kind of want to try it but they didn't have another one so I just got the one for her but I think I'm gonna order this once I'm done with my St. Tropez one the three hour express I love the express tans I prefer that over sleeping in them I know you probably don't get as dark but they're just more convenient one hour express sounds amazing so I got that. I also got her this. I don't know if it's any good and I don't know what she uses, but I've heard really good things about this. So I just got her the mini one. It was in like the checkout line. So I just got her this. I haven't tried it. So, and then I got this for me. I, I guess, derma play my face on the regular, probably like every other week or every three weeks maybe. I have not tried this brand. I've just tried like the little brands off Amazon or the ones that you can get from Target or something. But these are good and it's a pack of 12 and they were 10 bucks. So it just helps with, I mean, it says gently removes dead skin, cells, unwanted facial hair, smoother, brighter, more even toned skin, makeup applies smoother and more evenly, which I agree it does. Plus summer is approaching, we're gonna be out in the sun and when that sunlight hits your face at a certain angle, you can see the peach fuzz. These are a game changer. So I got them from Ulta, but yeah. So that's a little Ulta haul. I hope she likes her gifts and they don't have gift wrapping at Ulta. So I'm just gonna have to give it to her in a bag. Just got in the car and I'm so excited to eat Mexican food. I could eat Mexican food every single day of my life. I didn't touch up my makeup since this morning. Oh well, I feel like it's fine. It's getting dark out, it's okay. I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh, this Mexican food from Agave Azul, I literally dream about. I could eat it every single day. I remember when I first started going there like a few months ago maybe like last year we went out like every single weekend for like a month straight because it was just so good let me know in the comments down below what your favorite food is and what food you could literally eat for the rest of your life because mine would have to be like what category of food one specific food would be taco salad because that's what i usually get from agave it's so good and also I could probably eat like a shrimp tempura roll or a spicy tuna roll for the rest of my life too. Like I could also eat sushi for sure, but I really do wanna know what type of food you could eat for literally the rest of your life. What cuisine, like what type of cuisine and then also what specific type from that cuisine. Okay, I just got home and showered and put on Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask by Glow Recipe. I love doing this like once or twice a week. Doing some laundry and about to get in bed. And I wanted to end off this vlog. I'm trying to be better about ending off my videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.